Hello survivors! A new mode, customization, and more are featured in New State Mobile's October patch notes. M24C2 has been changed from the bipod to the tracking bullet. Once you hit a target, the tracking bullet leaves a visible indicator for your allies to see, even when they're behind cover. When applied with C2, M24's magazine slot can no longer be used and its reload speed will also decrease. We have created the auto fire feature for beginners who aren't yet accustomed to new state mobile's controls. Once enabled, your weapon will automatically fire shortly after locking on a target. For AR, DMR, LMG, SMG, SG, HG weapons, auto fire will activate for targets within 150 meters and 200 meters for SRs and crossbow. The auto fire feature can be toggled on and off in the control settings. We made some balance changes to weapons. MP155 Ultima's bullet spread has increased and the damage of M110A1 has also slightly increased. By enabling display in lobby for a weapon through the inventory, you can now use that weapon in the starting island. We made some adjustments to exhibit halt and team deathmatch for balance purposes. The positions of the previously asymmetrical central booth and box have been changed. Also, the escalator has been disabled to allow for better vision after arriving at the second floor. There will now be boats that spawn along certain shores in Aquinta. The Sunset Weather, which was previously available only for Erangel Extreme, is now available in Erangel Original. You can now enjoy Battle Royale games without the pressure of losing rank score. Simply toggle Ranked Mode off to disallow your match results from affecting your rank score. You can check the Ranked Mode icon displayed in the lobby to see which allies have enabled Ranked Mode. Auto Match will be disabled if a party member has Ranked Mode toggled off. To disable ranked mode, you must have at least 3,000 points in the mode and server that you have selected. Regardless of whether ranked mode was toggled on or off, all players will be matched into the same session based on the rank score of the highest tier member in your party. Certain rules have been changed for Bounty Royale. After you die, a portion of your prize money will transfer to your loot box and cannot be picked up by you or your allies. Kill prices for certain phases have been lowered. 150 for phase 2 is now lowered to 100. 400 for phase 4 down to 200, and 600 for phase 5 is lower to 300. Kill prices for phase 1 and 3 remain unchanged. The brand new recruit mode has been added to new state labs. This new mode for Akinta allows you to recruit much faster for a maximum of 8 players per squad. Once you complete a recruit on an enemy, your HP and boost will be recovered to 100%. We will continue to be introducing new content through new state labs, so stay tuned. Gain DXP for deathmatch combat level have been increased. EXP for kill, death, and knockout are all increased by 50%. EXP for wins have gone from 100 to 150 and losses from 30 to 75. You can now enable attachment skins for legendary weapons by using the new attachment tokens. Attachment tokens can be purchased and gifted from the NC store. Survivor Pass Volume 12 features Edward from the Hunter's Faction. Complete story missions to obtain Edward's outfit and appearance. New State Mobile's newest collaboration features Dead by Daylight. Check out the new upgradable weapon, new set of outfits, along with the collab story missions to obtain exclusive rewards. For more details, please check out our written patch notes. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in your new battlegrounds.